Hey what's going on guys and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a self-sufficient charcoal generator. So uh, this is essentially what it is, it's very small uh, and it's not a big efficient thing or something you'd keep, it's something that you'd most likely put up at a location where you're getting wood or want to get charcoal or you've set up a base or something and then you just take down afterwards and move, build it again somewhere else. Um, so it's very basic but that means that it's easier to build and that it requires less stuff. Um, it's also smaller. So yeah, so here's where we insert the logs. You essentially just put uh, normal logs, so you know birch, jungle, any type of log. So jungle probably be most efficient for this. Um, but I've just put some oak in there. Then goes into this furnace where it gets smelted. Charcoal goes into here, into this uh, dropper, and then puts it back into the system. Now that's this is essentially just putting it in a loop, um, and then the excess will build up here and then you can just obviously take it out and then it will take one every now and again when this goes down it's very efficient but you do need to keep an eye on it or it will overflow and just not work um, but as I said before it is very simple design and uh, it's not one of those big advanced ones that put it in a chest it's just retrieve it out of here when you're done with it take it down so essentially um, to build it it's obviously chest hopper furnace hopper then a dropper and a hopper. You don't need the signs. I'll show you from the back. Uh, as you can see, the, these are the directions. So that's pointing into there. That's pointing into there. That's pointing down. Uh, this is pointing up. Uh, and then you put a comparator coming out of the front of this dropper. Then you want a um, repeater with no ticks on it. Just leave it as it is. Two redstone dust and then another repeater but facing this direction redstone dust, redstone dust, redstone dust and then one last repeater pointing into the dropper and that is essentially it, it's very very simple to build um, very simple to put up, put down um, and operate so essentially it just builds up here, it doesn't put it into a chest or anything however um, I believe it would be fairly simple to you know just set up a little thing um, and just extend the amount of droppers you have uh, so then you can just put stuff into chests and make it you know automated so this can either be something you can have in your house if you make it a bit better um, by making it more efficient because this isn't, isn't the most efficient way to build it but it's the simplest um, which sometimes can be better um, but it, it it just makes life life easier if you need a lot of charcoal or you've just got a little base or something so yeah I hope you guys have enjoyed this hope that you found it helpful if you did a like will be appreciated um, so yeah, I'll see you in our next video guys. See ya.